We're going to do the top knot. Just brush all this back. Take your thinning shears. And where you shave the back skull here, just take your thinning shears and go right along that line. Blend it in really good. Just keep going until you can't really see a line. All the way around. Of course, the longer the top knot is, the more hair is going to come off and the longer it might take. But once you get it good, it'll stay that way for quite a while. So with the rest of this hair, You just start from one side and you're just taking the top off. You're not digging into it. You're just taking the top off. Same with the front. You're just sculpting it by taking the top off. And that is how any top knot can look good regardless of whether it has calyx or not. The biggest mistake is trying to train that hair or make it do something that it's not going to do. It's not growing that direction. So all you do is take the tips off, let it lie however it wants, and just take the tips off. That way it will be the shape that you want without having to worry about which direction it's going because it's more about the shape of the head than the actual hair. The method is the same regardless of whether the dog has a curly top knot, a straight top knot, doesn't matter. You just take the tips off. It doesn't look like you're taking anything off, but all you're doing is shaping the head. So once you're done, that's what it looks like. Clean, easy. Shouldn't take but a minute.